Okay, 2018, um, December the 8th, uh, we are starting the Harkerville hike, coastal hike this morning. Um, it's about quarter to nine. Um, I'm just going to do a quick tour of the hut. Um, this is where we slept last night. We arrived fairly late in the, in the evening. Uh, this is the main room. Here is a, one of the dorm rooms, quite a few bunk beds. Some fridge and sink. Here's the main dorm room. Very many beds. Sufficient space for quite a few people. And those are the ablution facilities with showers, hot showers, running water, toilets. That's the Brylapa. facilities. We arrived and the wood was already chopped. There was no axe here, but they gave us some tinder as well to start the fire. Here's another room, triple bunk beds, and yet another room, this is the last one, uh, the lighting might not be great, but once again, quite a few bunk beds. I'm just going to inspect the ablution facilities quickly. Ladies on the left, gentlemen on the right. Very nice and clean, tidy toilets. Shower facilities, as I said, hot and cold running water. Right, and then we're off to the trailhead. I'm going to start the hike now. I hope my group is still waiting for me. Yes, they are. stop the first bit of recording now. Okay, so from the Hockerville hut marker and the front door, there they are in the distance, that's the trailhead. And there you have some information pointing towards the office. There it is, you need to check in, supply identifi identification. And it says the Powder Corp Trail, Horses Head Trail. But this is where the Hockerville Coastal Hut starts. And it's about 10 to nine now. All right, here we go. Right, here's the first split in the trail. We are taking the right way, not the wrong way. That's the wrong way, it's coming back. 
and we're following the paddock trail. And we're actually heading towards the St. Clair hut. So that's where we're going to sleep tonight. Okay. And it's about, I don't know, about five minutes down the road. There's a second marker. And you just follow your nose. Paddock This is what the other one says. We don't want to go back. Going forward. Okay, that was a fairly steepish uphill, but here's the next marker. It's about another five minutes down the road. It's about nine o'clock now. Here you can see some construction vehicles in the back for purposes of nature conservation. Don't go down that path. We're following Paddockop that way. And here's the next split in the road. It's another five minutes. That's where we come from. And that's where we're going. According to that marker, don't follow that route. And here we go. Uh, it's about, that's just about nine o'clock now. This is the one kilometer marker. And it's now a little bit past nine. And it's about quarter past nine. This is Sinclair Hut. Go right, not left. All right, not wrong. This is literally 10 paces down the road. That's the next marker. And that was the wrong turn through the bushes over there, following a little path coming along. And you still want to go to the right over there. There's another marker. Oh, this is literally another 10 paces down the road. About half past nine. And this is the two kilometer mark. And there goes the trail. Coming up on another marker. Here we intersect the, the red and the green routes for the bicycles, I believe. That is not a footpath. The path goes that way. It's about uh, not much more than half past nine again. Here's a nice little clearing, perfect little picnic spot. Let's see where the road goes. Pardon the bumpy ride. Imagine that this is found footage. Hmm, there's a marker. It looks like uh, we gotta go to the left where them people are and not to the right where the bikes go. Red and green route. Some more red and green route over there, apparently that way. And uh, what's happening here? Not this way. And that's where we're coming from. And turning around. There we go. It's about, what? Not much more than half past nine again. And here's the three kilometer mark. It's about 20 to 10. Just about an hour into the hike. It's about 10 to 10 now. Here's another marker. We want to go to the right. That's better, cop. We don't want to do that anymore. We're going to St. Clair. Right, we had a nice long rest break over here. There's a tree arching over the path. It is now 
about quarter past ten. And heading on. Duck. And don't trip and wet the pot go. Oh there it is. Okay. And that's the four kilometer marker. It is now about quarter past ten. And that's the path. Whoops, there we go. This should be the escape route now. And there's a friendly indigenous person. That's the escape route, very good. Okay, St. Clair Hut going to the right. Escape route comes from the left, and there's a. So usually the people with the broken patella escape route. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's an inside joke, broken patellas, and uh, there's a sign indicating the green bike route going on the escape route towards St. Clair Hut, but we're going to take the long way around to the right. Right, this is just after the four kilometer marker. It is now about 25 past 10. And here we go. Actually, I need to add something to that last little bit. There's the green bike marker again. And some more markers. The escape route is specifically for vehicles to remove injured or ill people, sick people. Hello? Motion camera. Motion camera. Where, where, where? Oh, uh, there. Taking a photograph of a photographer. <laughs> Alright, St. Clair hat. There's the blue and yellow bike route. I don't know what the yellow foot is for, yellow footprint is for. But that's St. Clair hat going that way. Alright. And it's about quarter to 11. This is the five kilometer mark. And that's the path ahead. It is now about 10 to 11. And we have reached one of the greatest landmarks along the, the Hockerville Coastal Hike. These are the well-known uh, Californian redwoods. I'll move out into the road over there so you can get a bit better view just shortly. Um, this, I presume, is damage from the Nisner fires about a year ago and the trees haven't really grown back. I, I believe this was uh, actually a spot of uh, pine plantation or blue gum plantation. There we go, this is a nice shot. Look at them. And they just go higher and higher. It's just a small spot of them, small clump of these Californian redwoods over here. But this is like uh, one of the famous spots along the Hockerville hike. Uh, we got a couple of tree huggers here that want to hug the tree. There we go. Uh, Californian redwood. Some information. You can pause and read the read the blurb there. What else do we have? That's here. We have an indication of the the blue and the yellow bike routes again, going off into the distance. And. That might be the way we're going. Okay, let's pause there. I mean, pause. Okay, it's about half past 11. We've had a nice long break. And we're leaving the redwoods. Carrying on to the Sinclair hut. 